Materials needed. When doing facial, the first step that you need to do is to ask the client if they use any rejuvenating products to avoid the lemma. This is what we call consultation. A facial should begin with consultation. Ask about the drug and supplements they take and what products they are currently using. Second is cleansing. This is the first step is true cleansing using cotton pad. It used to remove dead skin cells, oil, dirt, and other pollutants from the skin of the face. Next is skin analysis. You need to determine what type their face is, either dry, oily, combination, sensitive skin, and normal skin, for you to be able of what product you're going to use. And now you can apply facial wash. Then wipe it using compressed facial sponge. Next step is facial scrub. It is a good way of removing dead skin cells from the surface of your skin. Exfoliating your skin can also prevent clog pores and bowel circulation and collagen production. Not only do face scrubs reduce acne breakouts, it can also give you a brighter and more even complexion. Then wipe it using compressed facial sponge. Next is steam. It directs a thin before warm steam to your face. This is relaxing and helps softens up any blackheads and whiteheads to be extracted. Next step is extraction. It is used to remove blackheads or whiteheads and give client skin a newer, fresher foundation for your skincare products to penetrate. Just be careful of doing extraction because people have different pain tolerance for extraction. Then apply toner before we proceed to the next step. Next is facial massage. It helps to promote healthy skin while relaxing your facial muscles. It has relaxing and rejuvenating effect, helping you look and feel better. Then apply facial mask. It is targeted to your skin type, then leave the mask for 20 minutes. Next step is the final application for toner, serums, moisturizer, and sunscreen. The use of toner is to remove any last traces of dirt, grime, and impurities stuck on your pores after you wash your face. And the face serums are used to target skin concerns such as anti-aging, dark spots and hyperpigmentation, acne and clogged pores, dehydration and lastly an even skin tone, redness and sensitivity. Serums should be applied twice daily. A sunscreen should be applied over the serum in the morning and the moisturizer appropriate for an individual skin type should be used over the serum at night. While the use of moisturizer, it reduces skin problems. Moisturizing every day can reduce the chance of developing extreme dryness or oiliness. Both extremes are harmful for skin and cause common skin conditions like acne. It also conceals other skin blemishes. Using a daily moisturizer ensures that the skin's blemishes are camouflage. Moisturizer, a cosmetic preparation used to prevent dryness in the skin. 
Moisturizer will leave your skin feeling fantastic.